Morning, Tasties. Hi. This is Tasty Yard Meal again. And today is a pork day. <laughs> it's pork, pork, pork. Call that pork. Mm. All right, so today I'm going to make some jerk pork. So one, this look like a lot. It's like four pieces in here, four big pieces. So I'm cooking some jerk pork and some brown stew pork. All right. So today's a porky pine day. All right. So this is what I'm going to do. It's already seasoning. This one have jerk seasoning. This one don't. Right. They look almost the same because I put just about the same seasoning time scallion. I cut up a chocho in there. Chocho, guys, again, it's a help. If the food or your meat is salty, it draws some of the salt. And another thing that can do that is papaya. All right. Green papaya. Almost just like chocho. All right. So we're going to get this going. You put your seasoning Season as you like and, you know, had your jerk seasoning. Again, I use grace, all right, and um, walker hood mixed together. So we're going to jerk this in the oven and we're going to serve it with some rice today, all right, and some vegetable. So we have jerk pork and stew pork, all right. I'll be back. Please like, share, and subscribe and tell me what you want to see me made Caribbean style. Right. Yeah, it's a fun this already. This is why I'm a little brown stew mistake especially. This I just put this in the pot No, no way I even start cooking it. It just it just time to bubble. Put some oil. I put a piece of um tomato paste. I put some sugar in the oil and two pieces of garlic. And fry them up right because my meat is already you know seasoned and this is what it looks like already look at that I know that's a lot of oil but it's gonna cook down but this is how I cook my bones right? so I'm gonna cover this up and make it go and then later this is chocho and the stuff them on the season rest of the stuff I'm gonna put them in but I'm gonna give it a little time to just you know marinate in the pot, cook down a bit and then bam I'm gonna put some tomato and some you know whatever else I wanna put in it alright just bring time it's so pretty so my Latin food look good and pretty so we're gonna let this cook and we'll be back alright let this cook guys for the peas for um rice and peas today this is something very simple, very simple. I'm going to cook this in my rice today. And this is green lentils. All right. So this is what I'm going to use with some coconut milk. Let's cook it like regular gunga or red peas and rice. This is just easy, very easy to cook. Cooking, I don't know, no time. <laughs> Still need to cook some, but I'm gonna have the rest of the stuff like the, the more water. But I'm gonna have the water that I seasoned it with. So I'm going to put it to the side, carrot, whatever you want, all right, and then just let this go on. I put some zucchini and some carrots, tomato, the chocho, and I'm gonna let this go ahead and cook. This is the peas right here okay. until it's soft. Okay, so I'm not gonna add any more water right now. I'm just gonna add the coconut milk. And today we are using the powder coconut here. So I'm just gonna open this and I'm gonna place put it in there and let it go and cook about five minutes and then I'm gonna add the rice and salt to taste, season to taste, and that's it. Alright, so this is it here guys, season to taste, 
and I'm using jasmine, all right? All right, they put thyme, scallion, you know, Caesar, pimento, so, you know, little bit of oil, so it won't stick because this is a, a nut and non stick back, you know. So I'm using jasmine rice, wash, I wash three times here. You can wash more if you want. I did it three times, all right? I'm gonna go ahead and put this on the low fire. All right, give it a stir. Spoon, fork, right now, it doesn't matter what you use to stir it. Just, you know, mix in the rice with your peas. All right, then say if you use fork, but right now, because it's not cooked, it no matter. All right, so just stir your pot however you want. Stir it, fork, spoon, stick. In your business, if I steal, use your hand if you want. All right, so if your hand can't take it, use your hand. If that's what you want to do all right so we grown people again and hey so coconut everything i might gonna tip like a water but i'm gonna go ahead and let it you know go and do its thing i'm gonna move it to the box stove there and let it go all right guys look at this all right see jerk pork yeah guys you know burn it just will bro all right it's just a melt seat. Just a melt. Look how easy that cut. Alright, see little gravy. I wanted it to be a little bit drier, but then at the same time I wanted, you know, a little stuff to eat something. This is oil mostly. This is not really it's dry. I don't want it to dry out. See how nice it look. Mm -hmm. Just a breakaway. Alright, so dry pork and then we have stew pork it's a porcupine deer guys anybody not eat pork today can eat here all right so this one cook on top of the stove and this one cook in the oven and guys the rice was getting on my nerve you know sometimes you get the rice and a rice just wouldn't come out good and some of it tough guess what i do i had to bake it in the oven i didn't even have file paper right i had to create my own file paper so it toast it on the side because i baked the rice for it to cook i had to create my own file paper here right because i not known guys me not known and i saw a rice come out right so you know too bad at least it cook because it wouldn't cook on his stove so i had to do the next best thing and this is it right so we have the rice we have some salad we have some mashed potato guys only video today with the mashed potato homemade mashed potato my daughter she work at this farm thing this for the summer and she brought home some potatoes and I boiled it and mash it myself. So it's just a spoon I use to mash it. I put sour cream, a little bit of milk and butter, salt and a little pepper. And this is it. Homemade mashed potato. And lastly, I made some salad. Right, so again, I washed the lettuce, cut it up tomatoes and cut up some carrots. And so this is it guys. Salad, mash homemade mashed potato, jerk jerk pork, not chicken, big old difference, and rice and peas. Right? This is green um green lentils, peas, and some stew pork. Guys, thanks for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe. It don't cost a thing. Please, thank you. May I beg you? All right, may I beg you? Just like, share, and comment. Okay, and subscribe, guys. There it is. This is dinner. All right, so stew pork. This is the stew pork. I didn't put any any jerk in it. This is dinner, and with this, I have some sorrel that I made. That was on a different video. All right, so this is dinner right here. Sorry, so I'm sorry to drink, make from scratch myself, and jerk, I mean, stew pork, or just pork. <laughs> All right, that's it. Thanks for watching, guys. Please like, share, and subscribe. See you next time. <music>